Do you need to remove a bearing from a housing for either overhaul or assembly production work? The Unisys drill press cutting tool is precisely engineered to cut out a bearing with no damage to the housing. I'm going to show you how it works. Start the setup by installing the cutting tool into the chuck of a drill press or vertical milling machine. Setting your workpiece on the primary anvil, make sure that the center piece goes through the bearing bore. Bring down the cutting tool to align the workpiece so that the pilot locates within the bearing bore and the cutter teeth touch down on the bearing V-groove. Next, we'll set the spindle stop to allow the cutting tool only to cut 25 to 35 thousandths of an inch below the initial contact point. The spindle speed will need to be adjusted according to the type of bearing. Check the documentation for a table of recommended values. Apply cutting oil to the edge of the bearing. Now, with the setup complete, you can start the spindle and bring the tool down in contact with the V-groove. Apply gentle and gradually increasing pressure. Alternate between cutting and lifting until the cut is complete. Once the contact stop point has been reached, the bearing is ready for removal using a Unisys portable install and remove tool. The Unisys Drill Press Cutting Tool maximizes the life of your components by allowing you to replace the bearing without scrapping the housing. This will save you time and money when successfully implemented into your workshop. In addition to all standard sizes, we also supply custom tools to suit any challenging situation. Please get in touch to speak with one of our engineers for technical support. Thanks for watching. Find out more at unisysbearings.com.